Got any identification? This emblem work for you? Oh, a Van Kingdom emblem. That works for me, yeah. You may pass. A paper airplane? There's something written on it. What's it say? Ah, uh, Roddick! Wait! What's he in a huff about? doing huh what it's no big deal it is too a big deal uh don't be stupid why are you writing letters you know no one's gonna read none of your business dear Roddick it's me Millie I never thought I'd be writing you a letter, given that I've hardly ever left your side before. But I don't even know where you are, so this is all I can do right now. I hope you made it to the past okay. I don't know how many days it's been by now. I want to see you. I just pray it'll be soon. I miss you. You crying, Millie? Oh, this is horrible. I'm never like this, ever. None of this would be happening if it weren't for him.
Millie! Roderick, I hate you! Ah! Roderick! Millie! Thank you so much for taking care of me, ma'am. Oh, you don't need to thank me. I enjoyed every minute of it. It was like having my own daughter here. Oh, Judy. Come on, Lucian. Say goodbye to our guest. I don't know what to do with this kid sometimes. Sorry, Millie. Don't think twice, it's all right. I'd better get going. Hang in there, Lucien. Wait! Millie! Are you really going? Yeah, I'm sorry. No! Please don't go, Millie! I... I... Don't cry, Lucien. Come on, where's the happy little Lucien I know? Cheer up, Lucian. You're a big boy now. You should be sending her off with a big smile. I know. Good luck, Millie. Come back sometime, all right? Of course I will. We'll play together again then, okay? Bye-bye. I sure am glad to see you in good spirits, Millie. You too, Ronix. Sounds like a lot's been going on while I was gone, huh? Sure has. We're finally within arm's reach of Asmodeus. That we are. Asmodeus is the host of the petrification virus. If we can collect a blood sample from him, we ought to be able to make the medicine we need. In that case, we'd better go see those kings as quickly as we can. Shall we head for the castle, then? We wish for an audience with the king. 
That's the Bad Kingdom emblem. One moment, please. Please, right this way. So, the time has come for an emblem bearer to appear before me, has it? Minister, take the guards out of the room. Yes, my lord. My royal family has been charged with the location of the Demon World entrance. There is a deserted island just southwest of Silverland where we are standing now. According to my knowledge, the entrance to the Demon World can be found on that island. Using the Eye of Truth there will open the door to the Demon World. A deserted island. Quite so. I will grant you full permission to freely use our port for this purpose. That will allow you convenient passage to both the Muon and Australian kingdoms. Of course, I will also instruct the ships to open a route to the island I've discussed with you. Feel free to make the voyage whenever you are ready. And one more thing. I want you to take this. This emblem is evidence that you know the truth, which has been passed down amongst those in Silverland. I wish you a safe journey. Thank you very much, Your Highness. Imagine finding a house out here. What's up with this place? No need to look a gift horse in the mouth. I could use a rest right about now.
kind of messy, huh? Yeah. Looks like someone's building some crazy contraptions here. Hello? Anybody home? Oh, finally! There you are! Do you have any idea how late you are? Huh? Whoa, you're a lot cuter than I thought. Boy, am I glad I came here. Uh, what do you mean? A lone explorer stranded deep in the mountains. Suddenly, he comes across a mysterious, beautiful young girl. What does fate have in store for them? And what will happen when their hearts finally beat as one? Ooh! Huh? Oh, wait, you brought friends. Yes, well, I guess we ought to apologize for coming in unannounced. We happen to be passing by, so we thought we'd stop in and get a little rest. Hmm. Well, curiosity is an important trait to have, I suppose. If you want to rest, knock yourselves out. There's enough space for all of you. So, what are you doing here? Already starting with the interrogation, I see. Guess you can take the girl out of the army, but you can't take the army out of the girl! What? Army? Oh, I mean, you know, that's how you look to me. <laughs> like some kind of fast-track subordinate officer or something. Wow, that's pretty impressive. You got it right on the dot. I have to admit, though, you're building some pretty amazing-looking things here. Like... this? Uh, uh... Welch. Huh? Welch Vineyard. That's my name. And those over there are all my glorious inventions. All kinds of wonderful things serving mankind in all kinds of wonderful ways. Huh. Pretty nice, I guess. Allow me to introduce myself. Yeah, yeah, you're Ronix and gang, right? Off to rid the world of Asmodeus and all that jazz. Word about us is already getting around? Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, rumors. Not like people go around proclaiming they're gonna whip the Archfiend every day, you know? The rumors have made it out here already? about little things like that. It'll make your crow's feet worse. What was that? But man, actually seeing you here in the flesh, it's like I'm kind of starting to wonder if you'd be willing to take me along. Huh? I want to help you out. I may not look it, but I'm kinda strong, you know? Opportunities like me don't come along every day. Besides, I'd like to test out some of my inventions. So how about it? You interested? Hmm, I don't know. It's a dangerous journey we're on. What do you think, Roddick? Well, if you're interested in helping us, I'd be happy to have you on the team. The more people we have, the better. Love a man who has the guts to make quick decisions. Ooh, this is going to be fun. In the midst of lethal danger, love blossoms after a chance encounter with the man of her dreams. Ooh, <laughs> I love it. Is that what you're after? Oh, uh, no. <laughs> what, you think I'm serious? I'm just messing with ya. <laughs> anyway, thanks for letting me in. I really appreciate it.
What do you think of her, Captain? Judging by her clothing and those inventions, I highly doubt she's a native of Roke. Do you think it's safe to trust her? Who knows? I have no idea what she's doing here. But then again, she doesn't seem hostile or anything. She's an unknown variable, I'll grant you that, but I think there's a lot of potential there. You're such an old softy, Captain. Maybe so, but you're hard as a rock, so it all evens out. You don't really think that, do you?